So let's have a look at Nilty on this, uh, sorry, the Goss in this match. And there's a wonderful... Being consoled here, Forrest Romney. Nothing at the moment is going to help, is it? No, nothing's going to help. But look, he... It was a step up and, and want to take it. And, and well, these things happen. So let's have a look at Nilty on this, uh, sorry, the Goss in this match. And there's a wonderful... The warmer to this match, Safwan, getting second yellow for... For what? I don't know. The referee turned around one, perhaps swing an arm out there. That's the official reason we were... But then immediately from that, he goes on to score the equaliser. Complains about this. Irfan Jaya was in behind. Central Rosa to goal. Would have been one-on-one. With Huck. And there was an arm from Irfan out there. So, not too many complaints. But this magic, this was the breaking Solomon scored in the 75th minute to make it all the odds. Nine man Singapore had the lead and it was absolutely electric after that. And they thought they might be able to perform the great escape until this moment here with just about four minutes left on. Pratama slots in. Yeah, credit to Pratama for his composure, but I think you're going to see from this angle that him, he's offside, he's clearly offside as the shot comes in. But he just got to get on with it, and he does, follows it, puts it in the back of the net. And the Tunisia back in it. To all then, we thought we'd probably be able to go to add a look at this Singapore. Given a big hit, a penalty decision. It looked like he got a touch, didn't it? Faris Romney stepped up. I'm going to save that one from Nadio. Indonesia! <laughs> He's saying thank you to Forrest. Great save by Nadio. And then Leon here. What an if this is from Zulkarnayan. That's a touch from Zulkarnayan. Delete. So the Griffin, the first strong arms from Hassan Sani and Shawal in a great position. Well-fensive header. Get it away from danger. Thank <laughs> you.